so I did start the game just to see what it was, what the controls were like, what it was like. Let's do it on normal. I'm not, I'm not feeling super hardcore right now. Just be Detective John Murphy. The heart and private eye, Murphy hails from the New Orleans Police Department, where he served under the celebrated Inspector LaGrosse. Murphy is tough, straight talking, and has a keen eye for facts and targets. LaGrosse had a profound effect on Murphy. It wasn't just the art of detection Murphy learned from the old man. In LaGrosse, he found the father figure he always learned. Grass returned from St. Louis, pale and withdrawn, after attending, of all things, the American Archaeological Society annual meeting, and suddenly retired. It so rocked Murphy that he also handed in his notice. Unwilling to work under anyone else, Murphy set up his own PI firm. On his desk, Detective Murphy keeps the exquisitely crafted Morgan statue of the crowd left him as a parting gift. Hard-boiled detective. You retire out of the blue. There's no contact for months. Murphy, stop. Go Hill, Massachusetts. Stop. Green God. Stop. Urgent help needed. Stop. Buy you coat. Stop. Learn you.
the members. Inside, you're enveloped by the twilight and the smell of old furniture. The walls of this old mansion are thick enough and impenetrable for extraneous sounds. They reliably keep their secrets, and only distant rustles and your heartbeat are audible. Oh, I can see our reflection. How lovely. Yeah, um, did it not change the stream description? I switched to this because I didn't want to sit here and troubleshoot Oblivion for forever. So, uh, I need to figure out what's wrong with my Oblivion stuff right now, but, yeah. If you're not giving your sandwich French's mustard, it may not like it. No! No way! Come on, listen to your food. French's is 100% all natural. No sugar, no artificial preservatives. Delicious. French's all natural mustard. Be good to your food. Neither. I'll have to add that option. What are you then, Ace? Uh. 
Okay. This will stop bleeding. Should we should we go ahead and use that? How long do we bleed if oh. we don't use that? what it seems like, so... Jeez. It's pretty brutal. Why not? Okay, now we have, um, so, so it looks like we did stop bleeding on our own automatically. Now we have two images. So I'm going to paste the bottom right back. These look like uh, nice couches. Definitely want to sit on these. Photograph. I should leaf through it. It's found in soft leather with Pond family embossed on the front. The first photograph I see is a staged sepia image of a rather charming looking family, consisting of a young man with somewhat nautical clothing and demeanor, a pretty young wife, and two children. Leafing through the pages is like a journey through the family's history. Oh dear. It seems the young mother is unwell. Her skin changes over time, and her posture hunches. Let's keep going. Oh lord, his wife's ill fortune seems to be taking a terrible toll on the sailor. He now poses far away from her, but with a look in his eye. The children are now young adults. They too have changed. An inherited condition, perhaps. Oh no. As I reach the last few images, the wife has vanished, probably dead of her disease, and the children. The last photograph shows the man slumped on a chair, the buttons of his shirt mismatched, a bottle of rum open behind him. Only one of the children is in this image, and the young man has already lost both of his ears. Whatever affliction visited this poor family, I hope I never see it firsthand. Lost part of your sanity. Great. Thanks for that, game. Is there a way? To, how do I keep track of my sanity? Uh, I just have health and stamina meters. Something hungry about this blaze. May a 
search the ashes, we need blaze rods. This fireplace appears to have been used to burn documents. Can't make out much from the fragments of paper. But there are a few names and locations which might help in my investigation. I'll make a note of. E. That's a lot of it. What's the point of these books I'm picking up? Are they just garbage? Should I drop them? Should I just drop the skull? I don't know. Like an ink splatter. <laughs> it represents how I feel. Seeing my chaotic emotions presented to me on paper, I don't know if I can keep doing this. Oh. Disturbing about this statue. Let's search it. There's an artist's name carved on the base. Daniel Morris. Have I read that name somewhere else? Have I? Was this purple over my uh, portrait? Is that my insanity? Oh, maybe I'm going insane too quickly. Is that an AK? Why can't I pick that up? idol has a head with the form of an octopus. Odd. It's a voodoo idol. I don't think this is a voodoo idol. That's just a voodoo statue. There's a golden tiara lying here. Of course we examine it. I'd say it was solid gold, were it not so light and lustrous. Tall in front, it seems to be made for a freakishly large and round head. It has striking and puzzlingly beautiful patterns, some simply geometrical, and some lamely marine. Can't I wear it? Talk to the mirror. 
There's a small mirror hanging here. Looking into it, I see that it's just me. Despite all that's happened, and may still happen, I'm still just me. You regain part of your sanity. Nice. Uh, we still have a lot of purple from all over us, though. Not, not thrilled with that. Ragged pages. They're covered in Rose's notes. I can make out Chateau Hill, built around a stone circle by Lafitte's outcasts. Probably butchering some of those French names, so I don't care. The battle has a head with the form of an octopus. Odd. like a helmet. A hole in the back like if something slides into it. Okay, so we're gonna have to combine items? I don't know what happens. I don't, I don't even understand the sanity meter. Like, it's just some purple stuff in the corner? Like, how big can this get before I'm Totally insane, I don't know. I do not understand. Hmm, so are all the chests surrounded by spiky death pits? Do I just have to YOLO it and hope that there's something in there that's worthwhile? <coughs> iron lock? Oh, I don't have an iron lock. Can't I pick those back up? Oh. No. What a waste. Let's see if we can see what type of chest was in that other one. So we know that one's an iron. thin book here titled The King in Yellow. I should read it. Huh, it's a play. The second act appears to be torn out. Someone's written on the back cover. Do not read this. Fear the pallid mask. Why didn't I read the back cover before reading through it? over here, just like a Venus flytrap, but with much larger jaws. I should tease it with my finger or leave it. Let's leave it. It's bad for flytraps to be teased. It is. That's clearly not a flytrap, though. Oh. It's 
set of medieval period European armor. Let's examine it. It's engraved with the words, those words. I'm never gonna try that. back together. I should poke the stuffing back in and put the doll back. I should leave a little. Uh, let's poke the stuffing back. Let's not use the pins on a voodoo doll of us. Let's poke that stuffing back in. Oh, we didn't break any sanity though. Just heal this. I was not paying any attention. I was looking at the mini map and I was like, okay, I'm just gonna walk across all this room. to the dangerous bits. Let's go forward. Let's not step into death. Iron key. You need to go back to that chest now. Probably shouldn't be going through our healing items as quickly as we are.
to use one of our Molotovs next time we have it. Castro and his followers aren't accepted by the Baratarians of the Bayou. They called them Cho Cho. Insult. Let's move on. I was panicking and going to my nap for some reason. Which, which, yes, does not pause. Which is horrible. <coughs> oh, a doll has. Everyone loves doll houses. Over here, huh? Gracious, there's a perfect little model of this very area. With a little model of me in there, too. How on earth did someone make that knowing I'd be here? That's amazing! Odd, but amazing and beautiful. Or should I just put my hand in and knock some stuff over? That's what I'm doing. Don't you dare laugh at my suffering. Did that make us more insane? I did, I did! I think I... A statue of a kneeling woman, as if she was protecting herself from her attackers. I should take a closer look. She looks terrified. It's unnervingly realistic, like a tiny three-dimensional photograph. The proportions are perfect. When I get very close, I could swear I can feel her shallow breath on my skin. Enjoy the hummingbird. Such a tiny thing, and so beautiful. All right, that makes sense. Birds uninsane you. It's true. gotta be in a bayou. An anchor. An anchor? Am I gonna go sailing? A silver anchor for the 
top seems unfinished, like there's a missing piece. Does Anchor say that? Maybe not. Dark chocolate. It calms the nerves. It is, it is. It's very relaxing. Book with pictures. Um, hmm. There's a star on this skull. I was going to drop it, but I don't know what that means. No, 715 and 2. Oh, is that because it's detective only? Okay, yeah, I think detective only things have that star. the least look useful looking book. We'll drop that. Man, that would be cool making a, a House on the Hill game. I would down with that. Uh, what is this thing? This idol has a head with the form of an octopus. I admire face or leave it. Should I, should I leave her with her privacy? I don't think I'll learn much occult information by looking at her face. doesn't seem very safe. Let's check it. Let's inspect it for safety. I opened it for a split second. I heard what I thought was a scream, but maybe it was just a hiss of steam. Oh no. There are the charred remains of a human hand still clasped together as if in prayer. What happened here? Declaration, the governor of New, of New York has released this statement. The laws prohibiting suicide and providing punishment for any attempt at self-destruction have been repealed. The government has seen fit to acknowledge the right of a man to end an existence which may have become intolerable to him through physical suffering or mental despair. Um, that's nice. Let's leave it. Okay, 
in shape of an anchor. Anchor goes here too. Is there a way to save? No. Is it just auto save? Oh no, it's a, a tiny Cthulhu. stone circle in various areas around the entire Americas. Also a reference to the Miskatonic University. The names Professor Lake and Professor Armitage. Insmith underlined and the rest is soaked in my friend's blood. You found new information about the Great Old Ones. Now you know more about the following Great Old Ones. Bagon, Cthulhu, Azatoth, We have so many bloody keys. Big on, yep. A strange place. Either you're dreaming or time and space have become mockeries. You're no, not Mayrun's Dagon. Um Probably he is based on that day gone? I don't know. Probably not, actually. I don't know. Maybe. Maybe. Either you're dreaming, or time and space have become mockeries. Your head swims frightfully, even though there are no visible objects in the unbroken gloom to swirl around you. Then, in the far distance, a pinpoint of light expands. The pressure of Earth meets your feet, and you feel gravity pull on you again. The hair on the back of your neck stands up, find yourself in a room in which everything seems designed by someone who knows its purpose, but has never once used it. Yeah, I don't know. I think most of the Daedra are probably original creations of their role-playing game. Let's check the board with the evidence. Chance of victory have increased. And knowledge is power. Oh. Oh, okay. So I guess we'll be dealing with these five dudes. This can be found in the story of the character Ghoul. Can I play as a ghoul? So that's what happens when you get too insane. Um, okay, my story's over. John Murphy died of sanity loss. Okay, at least it's restarting us in chapter two. Oh, but we're still just as insane. That's hilarious. Oops. Right, so we won't look at 
that body. Okay, so it's like a, a vault. I can store my loot. Can I split stacks? Okay, I got I don't think we need more than five. I don't think we need any of these books. Or skulls. Bones of a human leg, there's no flesh left. Oh, do I want to strip all the bones? Am I going to be collecting like a whole human skeleton? Yeah, okay, we'll keep the bones. We got a lot of money for this treasure. Wow. Sell it? Don't stack more than three. Yeah, how do I sell the treasure? I don't know. I'm completed, I feel safe. What's this? A hospital, much like any other in appearance, but there's an uncanny chill to the white of the walls, and the cleanliness seems deceptive. You feel as though if you ran a finger under any sort of sleep, you'd be clotted in blood, festering out of sight and out of mind. Love the aspirin. Examine it. This makes no sense. I can't see how this would work. There are cogs standing alone, wires not attached to anything. 
a light bulb not plugged into anything, pipes going nowhere. It's as if a lunatic child looked inside a wireless radio or a clock and tried to make one out of odds and ends. certificate in medieval metaphysics from Arkham University. Odd, how did this get here? The University of Arkham hereby awards a sentence weight, an honors degree in medieval metaphysics. So much cool out. have like a full skeleton going on. Do we get any cool stuff in the skeleton? Nice. Where can we sell stuff? of an icy mountain. Examine it. It's a gorgeous, stylized piece with chromatic colors. It depicts an icy Antarctic visage with a mightily mountainous glacier in the center with the suggestion of an almost human expression. 
One moment it fills me with a sense of awe, the next with the sense that we impose upon natural phenomena our own insecurities and preoccupations. I am left with the nagging feeling that perhaps nature itself has a motive or a mind we are not privy to. Oh, I regained sanity from that? Hells yeah, it sounded like I was going to maybe lose sanity. There's a syringe here filled with a cloudy liquid. Mother's milk is scratched on the side. Oh no, what sort of options are these? Let's leave it. Let's leave it. I don't I don't need the mother's milk. We can always come back for it. Sounds like the sort of thing that will make us lose sanity. Is that mostly what this game is about? Like, knowing when to examine something or not? Let's examine it. Not so creepy. What I first took as a filthy human, or rat, or a dog, with hands cowering in a small alcove, is actually a titanic monstrosity gnawing on the head of a fully grown man. It must be an enormous cave. It reminds me of a mockery of Goya's depiction of the Feast of Saturn, as if the painter intended to invert the assumption that humanity is the pinnacle of creation, and that the divine order is actually made up of monsters and degenerates. Signed, Pikmin. We found Pikmin's gallery. dead body. I examined the dead body. For an autopsy, this cadaver is crisscrossed with suture scars. Bits of skin seem to have been transplanted from other bodies. Limbs transplanted. Even the eyes are mismatched. What's most disturbing is that the scars from the stitches are fully healed, and some appear fresher than others. As if this person underwent many many unnecessary transplants. I wouldn't have expected someone to be able to live through that many drastic procedures, let alone retain the function of the limbs. Okay, I might be losing my sanity if I'm getting big info. An army listed sensor taker's journal. Oh no, this man's very insane. It's mostly just a record of expenses and lists of the numbers of Sensor taker made a note about a few locations, however. The village of Dun Dunwich is described as having young men who are nearly uni nearly I'm assuming I should say universally nearly universally unsuitable, apparently inbred, possibly affected by toxic substances in the ground or water supply. The town of Innsmouth has a high rate of alcoholism despite prohibition, apparently an inherited degenerative disease that affects the vast majority of young men, although many unsuitable candidates express interest in the Navy. The town of Kingsport rings a bell, has had a recent influx of Italian, Sicilian, and Irish immigrants, many of whom would be suitable. And Arkham also has a note, high student population. Why'd that make me insane? Anything that can make me less than 
same. I guess not. Nothing that looks like it would be good for uh, sanity, though. So I guess that was like a checkpoint, a save point. of my hand! Examiner. It does look like the stinger of a bird or an insect. It also appears to be a bug. Okay. We're not more insane. So that's good. Bring my treasure. Oh no. This book is written in Greek. Let's go see if we can get that treasure. Eat our 
dark chocolate. Traumas. What are traumas? I don't know. I don't know what traumas are. Okay, so that room gets a special color. Noted, there are deep channels apparent in the moon's surface, strongly suggesting that water does or did flow on its surface, and that the moon may, indeed, have an atmosphere. It is also important to note that half of the moon is perpetually facing away from the Earth in the scrutiny of our telescopes, the so-called dark side of the moon. It may well be that vegetation and even some forms of simple life exist on Luna's surface, and that we may one day be able to view them, or even send radio signals to them. Click. I'm sorry, the thought of life on the moon deeply unsettles me at the moment. Why? And that made me regain sanity? I do not understand some of this logic. <laughs>
magnificent image of great great fruit. Quite literally, yes. Oh. Atlantis, you will, you will die. Oh, no, don't open up Chrome. Spooky men. What do you do? What? Drugs, guns, ammunition. You can buy Gubosathla's preoccupation. Brown Jenkins paw.
this body's skull is intact. The other bodies have their brain pans open. Perhaps if I reanimated this one, it would be less violent and I could get some information. What? How do I do that, though? How do I reanimate? Why is this room with the chest also purpley colored? or render down something. People wrapped up in this thing, whatever it is. They may be unhinged, but they're not stupid. Survive you, dude, if you promise to be a good zombie. New syringe. His body twitched in convulsions and his eyes opened. What happened here? Oh my, I swore I'd had it. It was Kilgareth. She injected it. Then she spent hours talking with it. One day, I came in and the lab was overrun with the dead. It injected it. Listen, we don't have much time. Shortly after the Vermont floods of November, a literature tutor from Miskatonic University in Arkham alerted us to sightings of bizarre objects in the rivers of Montpellier, Wyndham, and Caledonia. The locals referred to them as Migo, or Mountain Men, but they're outer ones. Fungi from deep space. We took the samples back here. Thankfully, they were quite dead. Then that fool Dr. Kilgareth suggested using the liquid from Project West on them. You know, for extra data. It's imperative I get through this door. Kilgareth might have vital information. Oh, very well. The numbers are four, five, one. Use my pass key. Dr. Kilgareth so loves her little games. I'm feeling much better for that, thank you. Or should we be going into 
one of those tentacle doors. I don't really want to go into the tentacle door. Laboratory. The equipment in here is clearly high quality and well maintained. We have a hard time discerning the facility. In the distance, we can make out muffled sounds of machinery. And there's the smell of ozone in the air. A device with a living brain inside it is marked with the number B74. This device consisting of many tubes, cylinders, and hoses.
skeleton parts.
shouldn't be wasting all my Molotovs. No! I shouldn't be wasting those either. Like these bones. So for very little. A lens machine. Okay, so.
So this was evil tentacles over here. There's only one place. back here. Yeah. Let's go back to the machine room and maybe uh, maybe we can figure out what to do there. Maybe it's not an extra machine I need. Maybe I can put the tube machine in the one to the left and the middle one. Maybe I put the brain in that one to the top. It looks like a
Oh, it's literally the only room left. Oh, there's a chest. We have keys. Let's open it. Oh no, we don't have keys. We have silver. Do we? We do. Also 
we hit up the
found new information about the great old ones. Check the board with the evidence. all these things to sell. Another level might put me over when I want to finish streaming. Um, I also want to maybe work on actually getting Oblivion working, so I think I'll be doing that later. Thank you for uh, hanging. Thank you for watching. Tomorrow I'll hopefully be doing some more Oblivion. Uh, if anyone wants, I'll play more of this. This is fun. Um, I don't know when though, so I don't want to do this instead of Oblivion. But maybe. Maybe I'll find time to do some of this sometime. Peace out.